Alright, welcome back. In this video, we are going to learn how to create a new sequence that automatically match your video clip settings. Alright, without further ado, let's get started. Alright, so we're inside the Premiere Pro. So now we know how to create a new sequence in few different ways. Alright, I know you know that. Let's try to create a sequence that will automatically match the source or our video clip. So to do that, let's go to the project panel, here in the project panel. Look for the video clip that has the settings that you want for your settings or for your sequence. So let's go to assets, uh, go to video, and all of the video assets here were shot in 1080p. So we just need to find the clip, let's say this is 007 fulls, I'm sure, you know, to find what is the uh, frame rate and the uh, uh, the frame size of this clip just to be sure or if you want to review that clip you right click on the video and you choose properties where's the properties there you go now in properties you will see here the size of the image which is 920 1920 by 1080 all right and the frame rate is 23.976 or 24 frames per second so now we are sure that this 007 folds was shot in 1080p right so we're going to create a new sequence that uh, we're going to create a new sequence that has 1080p settings. So to do that, all we have to do is to drag this video specific video clip to our new item. This one, this icon is our new item. Right. So if you drag this and release the video inside of that new item, boom, it created an automatically a new sequence with the same name of the video clip which is 007 false. So this is not uh, a video clip anymore. This is a whole sequence that you can add. All right. Bunches of video clips. All right. On our timeline. All right. And the good thing about this sequence settings, it has the same settings of the video clip that you just added. So it will make a better performance because um, now since we have the same settings of the clip, and sequence you will have a better playback experience because your system will work less since there's no need to conform or to convert different um, different formats to playback different clips because your system will work less since there's no need to conform or convert uh, to playback different clips on this settings all right so to play just hit space to play that Right, so as you can see, it's kind of running smooth because it has the same settings of the same sequence. All right, your computer is working less. All right, that's it. That's how you create a new sequence that automatically matches your source clip settings. I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, you're really doing great. All right, just keep it up and see you in the next video.